I'm Kate and this is a come thrifting with me video come to the charity shops I'm filming this as an extra intro though because I've got to do it the other day I just went straight in I was like it's 10 o'clock but I didn't say hello or anything so I thought I'll just quickly film the intro for this vlog so I hope you've had a nice week um hello and sending love to everyone I've got Rufus here who's having he's not snoring yet he's just having a little rest and then Bestie's behind me Bestie Hello, he might have moved his ear a bit. Um, my mug of the day, before I say anything else, is this lovely one here. No, I'm okay, I thought I had lipstick and coffee, but it's fine. This is um, was a present from my friend Louise. I think it's TK Maxx originally, and I've got a coffee in my mug of the day. But it's, I've nearly drunk it all because it was my one from just before. So I'm gonna stop talking now and get into the video. So I hope you enjoy it. I haven't done one of these videos in ages, and it felt really nice actually to be filming in the charity shop. So I do hope you enjoy it. And what I'm gonna do is in a minute record my haul that I found. So I, I found some lovely things. So I'm going to film the next part of this video and have it ready for Sunday. So there'll be like a follow up to this one. So that'll be Sunday morning at 8 a.m. All the treasures that I found during this shopping trip. So look forward to that video and I'll say goodbye now and enjoy the video and I will speak to you Sunday morning with my haul. So I hope you enjoy it. And I'm now in my car, ready to head to the charity shops. It's about 10 o'clock. Well, it is. It's five past 10 in the morning. And I'm going to go to Stalham charity shops because I haven't been there in ages. I think it was like February the last time um, that I've been to the Stalham charity shop. So I thought I would head over that way and see if there was any bargains. I've got my things already. I've got a bottle of water in this lovely reusable bottle that I really like actually because you can get loads of water in it. Louise, my friend, bought the same bottle. It's Polar Gear and it was in Home Bargains and it's got little like pom-poms all over it. It's very cute. So I've got my water, I've got my hand sanitizer, I've got my Home Bargains mask to wear, emergency banana, shopping bag, money, wallet, purse, sunglasses you don't need to know about the sunglasses but i'm gonna put them on in a minute because it's really sunny and nice and bright so it's a lovely day and the thing i really am um, enjoying about charity shops at the moment because obviously it's different everyone's shopping all wearing masks and keeping you know keeping our distance social distance shopping but charity shops are just i'm really enjoying shopping in them because they're so well organized so as you go in they've got the hand sanitizer and you have to hand it you have to hand, you have to sanitize your hands and then um you can only, they only allow a certain amount of people in the shop so i'm feeling really safe when i go charity shopping so that's what i thought i'd film today and bring you along with me because i haven't done one of these videos in ages so i hope you enjoy it and with that i'm gonna get going and i'm now in stellum i've got some free parking there's some spaces all along the high street and you can park i think it's for half an hour or might be an hour and I've just parked here, so I've got my first charity shop just, I'm literally right outside of that's the Priscilla Bacon charity shop. And they've got some things outside that look really nice. So I'm going to have a look at those. And I didn't say earlier on, just in case you didn't know, Stalham is like a little town in Norfolk in the UK. So I just thought in case you didn't live around here, you'd be like, what is Stalham? But it's just a nice little place and they've got some good charity shops. I think there's about four or five here and they're, they're usually quite good. So I've been looking forward to coming along and seeing if they have any treasure. And I'm gonna start off with this one right here. Like I said, the Priscilla Bacon Charity Shop. I'm just outside, they've got a lovely picnic basket there. Really cute vintage one. There's little plates and things. Cushions, some Lego, like jugs there. Oh, I quite like those, the £2.50. Lavender metal jugs. I'll have a look at those actually. So I'm just gonna go inside and see what else they've got. Just going to have a look at the dresses as well. Mm -hmm. 
and I managed to find a few things in that charity shop so I will be showing you soon in a charity shop haul and I'm going to head over the road and go to oh no it's shut the poppy centre one. Oh, I love that one so that's closed I'm just going to keep walking down and hopefully there'll be a few more that are open so that one is closed and I'm going to keep walking along that's a really good one though I used to love going there This one's closed as well. Jimmy Tuli's, but hopefully they will um they'll open at some point in the future. And this one is open, so I'm gonna put my mask on, get my antibacterial hand sanitizer and have a look in here. And I'm going to get these plates, they're £1.50 and I think there is, how many, one, two, three, I think there's six, so that's really good. And I also found a few things in break charity shops. So again, I will be doing a charity shop haul very soon. I think there's one more to go to up here, one more RSPCA charity shop, and that is it for Stalham. Looks like there's a bit of a queue, but I'm gonna wander down there anyway. So this is the final one I'm gonna go into. Got some things outside here. Oh, it's a pound rail. Have a little look along here. we got out here some bits and bobs right, see what's over here big chicken hello big chicken and i'm all finished with the charity shops in stalham and i managed to find some bits in here as well some lovely homey bits so i will do the haul very very soon but yeah that was good i found lots of treasure in stalham today so i'm going to go back pick up my things from break charity shop and then head home and I had a chat to the manager in the RSPCA charity shop and he said that business um, was really good. He said it was as good as it was last August, which is brilliant. So I'm so glad the charity shops um, aren't suffering. They're doing really well. It's nice because you don't want to spend too long inside big shops, do you, with the mask on? Because you just, well, I get really hot. So it's just great going to charity shops, seeing, you know, looking at all the house bits and the dresses and items that I would normally look for and then um, coming out. Also, you can't be too long in them because there's people queuing up to get in as well. Uh, everyone is looking for secondhand treasure, which is just brilliant because there's lots to be found. Everyone's donating, well, loads of people are donating things as well after lockdown. So it's a good time to be shopping secondhand and all the precautions are fantastic. They're so careful. So I do feel really safe um, charity shopping. And I just picked up the other things from Break Charity Shop because they were a bit heavy. I couldn't carry them back a lot. Well, I probably could have done, but I might have broken them all. But I'm going to end this vlog here because it was just more of a like look around the charity shops type of a vlog. So I hope you enjoyed it. It was nice doing this again because I haven't done one of these in ages. So I'll try and do more of them when I go around the charity shops. I've also done a little, I filmed some clips for Instagram because there's a new thing called Reels and they're just it's nice to do little snippets so have a look on instagram if you want to see that little video as well i'm kate mccabe on instagram and i've got a house account called kate's homely home there'll be links in the description you can probably see i bought a couple of cushions they were brand new um from priscilla bacon charity shop and then as i went back that way to get the car 
a lady picked them up and I thought, well, they look lovely. And then she put them down again and then I bought them. But I'll show you those in a haul properly. I think they're from the range originally. They're brand new with the tags and um, they were a really good bargain. So I've got those as well. Yay. But it's really hot. It's a hot day and um, it's hot in my car and I'm starting to sweat. So I'm going to end this video here. I hope you did enjoy it. If you did, did give it a like and make sure you subscribe. Thank you for watching. Have a lovely day. Enjoy the rest of your week and I will speak to you soon. Bye. I will also link um, some other videos in the description that I've done lately in case you want to watch them. Okay, I'll go now. Take care. See you soon. Bye.